Alola everyone, today we will be talking about a subject that will open up wounds, healing wounds that will be reopened, we will be talking guys no other than Ash Greninja, yes guys it's time to talk about this fool in this episode guys, now in today's question video I want to know will Ash Greninja or Greninja in particularly return in the Sun and Moon anime, will re possibly return in the end of the Sun and Moon anime, one of the trials? That is the question for each and every one of you to answer in the description below. Now I'm going to be putting my take and a few evidence and speculations, I guess you could say that guys. Alright, let me talk about my speculations and my little theories and everything like that and all that jazz. Now the first thing that really really caught my attention guys is drawing episode 1 where Ash's moms talk about how they, you know, won the lottery to go to the Alola region for a trip. And during that flashback, the really interesting thing is that Ash gave Professor Oak five Pokeballs. Yes, guys, that is right. If you caught that split second moment, well, two second moment, I guess I could say that. Ash hands over, you know, Professor Oak five freaking Pokeballs. And we all know that Ash always have to keep, you know, Pikachu's Pokeball at all times. So really, really interesting. That's what I thought in this particular moment that, wow, Ash gave five Pokeballs. If, I don't know, I don't know if you release a Pokemon, I believe it, the Pokeball, I don't know. I think I've seen this in the past few series or something. Maybe it was Snorlax. I don't think so because Snorlax's Pokeball, I believe he crushed it, but he wasn't released or he didn't lose, you know, the obey. He didn't, he stopped, you know, that freaking technical stuff. Now, the really interesting thing is that he hands in five Pokeballs. And the biggest question is, guys, that... Are these five Pokeballs, and well, five, not all of them, but are those two Pokeballs that we see in Professor Oak's hand empty or not? I'm not too sure. Well, it's really, really hard to explain, guys, is that I hope that Ash, I hope this is a clue that Ash did not release, you know, Gudra did not release Ash Greninja. We all know, all know that Gudra stayed at the wetlands, is Ash's Pokemon for for life and everything like that, but Ash Greninja is another different case. He's right now, he's in the, he's a wild man with the hippies in the forest and all that, mountain hills and all that. He's just being Greninja over there. He's just losing brain cells, but still, that is really, really interesting, guys, that they have, you know, Ash just throws five Pokeballs, so that, that means that... Uh, uh, Ash Green Ninja could potentially, you know, come back into the series. Now, there is another clue as well, guys. I don't know. This is just speculation, but really, really interesting thing is that Ash has the roulette. He has a grass type. Ash could potentially get lit in the far future. And the water type. Who will be Ash's water type? That is another interesting thing. And another little interesting thing is that we all know that he cannot get my son Poplio because Alana has Poplio. So that's out of the question. So who will be Ash's water type for this region? Um, th this is another re interesting thing. It will be really interesting if Ash goes through the whole trials with five Pokemon on him. And almost at the end of the major trial, whatever, Ash gets, you know, Ash is missing that last Pokemon. That will be really interesting. Last, last Pokemon and it's has to be a water type that he's missing and uh, I don't know that could be another thing that they could take something out from the XY series Ash almost he was missing for the six freaking Pokemon for almost seven almost 25% of the series they, they, they could pull something here as well we all know unless Ash catches a water type then this theory is out Greninja's never gonna come back but I think that's about it guys I blab too much I try to explain these five Pokeball little theory really interesting that they showcased it I don't know guys I hope Ash did not release Ash Greninja in the wild and there's an evidence that he did not well who knows only time will tell and Ash Greninja is based off the Sun and Moon anime transformation, you know, Z moves, but he's different, he's different. We don't even need any freaking physical crystals, whatever, to transform. That will be another freaking amazing thing to showcase, you know, the professor, everyone in the freaking Alola region. But, you know, he's based off the Sun and Moon, you know, power-up thingies and stuff like that. And really, really interesting. I would like to hear your opinions on all of this theory. And I hope I explained myself well in the beginning. I was like a little bit all over the place. But still, guys... Just a little small theory in a small video to showcase and my ideas for the, you know, anime progression and stuff like that. Eh, these are the type of videos we're going to see, you know, interesting videos here and there, discussions here and there. And I think that's about it, guys. Oh my god, that egg. That egg. Oh my god. It's Lily and Ash shipping. It's born. 
killed me. And that's about it, guys. I've been your host, Win. And one more thing. Have a great day.